So this is it. Domestic football across the continent may all be done and dusted in the major leagues. But now we have the ultimate spectacle to conclude the season. The earliest phase in qualifying started way back at the beginning of last summer. And now there are just two teams standing. A show not just for the capacity crowd here, but one for the whole world. The global audience, they say, some 300 million. The question that this is one of the most striking structures in all of sport, the Allianz Arena. So we're almost there, all one can see, a look of utter focus on the faces of all involved. You've been there, Jim Begley? Or maybe thinking as they wait for the whistle. Well, you're right, Peter, I have been in this position, and the message is usually something like, remember all the work, the hard work you've put in to get this far. So don't leave anything out there now. Do what you're good at. Marquinhos is the guilty party there. But he can't say now that he hasn't been warned. Well, I think the referee would have told him to rein it in or, or suffer the consequences. Kimmich. Mbappe. And the counter-attack could be on for Paris Saint-Germain. Surely... Davis. And it's Sané. That's surely a foul free kick. Well, the referee has made it pretty clear now that this is his last chance. Yeah, and he's just entered the last chance saloon. One wrong move now, and he's in trouble. He goes long. Hernandez. Di Maria. It's Di Maria! No, that wasn't kidding anyone. Di Maria certainly had to make his mind up quickly, and he rushed it. And the counter is on. Messi! And he comes up trumps again. Yeah, well, he won't be happy with some of the defending in front of him. He can hold his head high. That was a fantastic stop. Wijnaldum. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Marco Verratti. Messi looking to penetrate. And Messi! Well, that wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. Paris Saint-Germain really putting a few chances together here. Taking one can only add to such good momentum now. Pavard, who is there to heave it away. Davis. Pavard goes looking. Bayern Munich can't make any sort of inroad despite all this possession. Marquinhos. That's really nice. Now, what next? Davis does well to read it and intercepts. And here's Messi. Mbappe. How about a shot? Neymar. In for the pieces. He's got away with one there. And it's Messi. A buccaneering run from the defender. And the shot! And the ball, real chance! Oh, great save, real class. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class. Great lead! Goal! Terry Saint-Germain! Could that be the start of something big? Great corner, and he did the rest. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted it to that net. I think when it comes to the area of the park, this fella has definitely no sledge. Paris Saint-Germain have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? Well, Peter, the emphasis should now switch to winning it. 
rather than even thinking about losing it. Here it comes. Koman. Towering header. We've got a goal. Bayern Munich are all square. What a super header. Dispatched beautifully. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Has certainly made things interesting. Well, there's resilience for you, Peter. As a side, they never lost focus despite the setback, and this is thoroughly merited for me. Now they can go one better, possibly. And shoots! He can pounce on that. Goal! Terry Sanjaman! And they're back in front. Moore reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. I might sound a little harsh here, but the keeper, I felt, could have done a better job in ensuring that ball didn't go back out into the danger area. Paris Saint-Germain take the lead. Hernandez. Davis. And it's played forward. Fine Eldon. Neymar. Can he get through? It's come. He's had a goal! Disappearing out of sight. Oh, what a cracking goal, but a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all around. Paris Saint-Germain take a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt we'll be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Davis tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Bayern Munich can't seem to retain possession. Koeman has a pop! There's a goal! Deep into first-half stoppage time, a crucial goal! Oh, how's that for a class finish? I just thought he knew exactly what he was doing by feigning to move one way and then readjusting back. Control trickery. This is threatening to become a really good game. Well, whistle's gone, and we've reached the halfway point of the final. Half time in the final, Jim, how do you read it? Well, it's obvious who's likely to be more content going in at half-time, but I sincerely hope that there's a, a fitting response from the opposition to really engage us on the big occasion. So what a half. So many talking points, so many goals, so much drama. It's 3-2. Just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. What a change to either side during the break. Jerome Boateng. Goretzka. Lewandowski. And here's Goretzka. Shapes the shoot. Oh, what a wonderful stop! Goretzka really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. With his head, but couldn't steer it in. His radar picked up on that very quickly, and he was first to react. Mbappe with the foul. Forward it goes. 
Hernández. Neymar has created one goal already. Talk about singling someone out. Yeah, his instinct and the timing of his runs have proven fruitful, but they have to give him a harder time like that. Messi. Coleman drives it forward. It's got through to him. Sané! Oh, surely that deserved better. Sané made himself the key component of a very good move. That's how you get behind the defence. Verratti plays it forward. Wijnaldum. Mbappe. Now it's Messi. He's left his man. Forward pass. Sergio Ramos as well there. Alert. It's a bit too casual in possession. Gets the better of his man. And Messi! Chance! Mbappe. Oh, he has a goal! Oh, it's die-hard defence and the willingness to put his body on the line. Very impressive. Hoists it forward. <laughs> Whistle's gone, that's uh, foul. And he has shown him a yellow card. When it needed something decisive, he showed too many mixed signals. Over to the left. Bernat will try cutting inside here. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Douglas Costa plays it over to the other flank. Well, they can break here. Mbappe. He's through, now is he in? Paris Saint-Germain are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. Messi, Messi! Sticks it away! And surely that does it! Perfect time, decisive strike! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Has changed the dynamic somewhat. And it's Messi. Di Maria. Hakimi. Messi. Big chance! Well, the. Hernandez with the clearance. Bullock tries to get it forward. That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. And he's there to cut it out. Board shows there will be three extra minutes. Now it's Neymar. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Jerome Boateng. And that's that. Paris Saint-Germain have done it. It is party time as they gather to get their hands on the trophy. Whoa.